Hey, what happens when schools ban chocolate milk? Well, I'm Dr. Brian Watson from the Cornell Food and Brand Lab, and what we did is we looked at 17 Oregon elementary schools to determine what happens if all of a sudden they ban chocolate milk. Well, the first thing that happens is 8% fewer kids drink milk at all. The second thing that happens is that those who do drink white milk end up wasting about 29% of it. And the third thing that happens is that 7% fewer people eat lunch in the cafeteria. So if you're thinking of banning chocolate milk from your school, think twice about the chocolate milk consequences of getting rid of it and whether it's worth it for your kids.